All right, so I basically finished my War Gods project today. I put the uh, control panel together, all the buttons together. I'm missing two green buttons for a low kick and low punch right here for uh, player one. You can see I just put blue ones in, but um, game's up and running. I uh, put the marquee in. I uh, drilled plexiglass for this here, installed the 3D buttons here. Um, did all the joysticks here. Everything works good. Uh, proper placement of all the things. I didn't put the security screws in because uh, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with this. Uh, coin door works, both bulbs light up. <clears throat> I'll show you the back of the cabinet here. Here's a PCB. Here's the uh, harness that I made right here, similar to a uh, Mortal Kombat. Actually, it's the exact same thing. Here's the hard drive. The issue I was having before with this machine is the um, there was a, a not enough power coming in, so the seller that sold me this whole kit sent me this computer uh, power supply right here that's actually uh, made for this game. I kind of jimmy rig some of the power wires here to fit in an MK2 cab with um, different, basically the uh, plus and minus 5 volts and all that good stuff. I kind of tied it in there, but you can see everything's working good. I'll show you a little gameplay on the cabinet. Um, go through the menu here. I got the dip switch number 8 on. Um, that, that allows you to get into the menu, which is right here. Switch it off. You just go here, and it says hit any button, and it gets up and running. I'm not sure, I, I, I don't remember playing this game in the arcade, what the 3D buttons do, these two big ones here. I haven't wired them up because the uh, wire harness I made is a little too short under here, as you can probably see. You can see how tight these wires are right here. I'm going to have to extend them a little bit for some of the, like here's one right here that goes to one, and the other one's right here. But um, also, the three buttons have these crazy little connectors. I'm not sure if you can see it right there. It's the sideways one. Right there, and uh, they light up, but I don't have any light bulbs to put in there. But here's a game. You can see this is a standard resolution monitor and I put it in a medium resolution monitor the first time I got it. It looks exactly the same so I can't say that the difference between standard and medium makes such a big difference that you can't tell. But you can see it's, it's definitely fast. There's no delay. You know, like when you play this in MAME and you play it um, when it's not a dedicated uh, arcade board and all the, uh, all the emulators, it doesn't play as fast as it does here. So. Just a little update on the cabinet. I'm going to have to figure out the control panel side art because this is the MK4 that I was going to build, but you can see it all works nice. i got to get a bezel and a few other items, but that's it.